today's project of the week video will focus on how to use the Lightburn software to make a laser cut name tag. The first step to setting up the laser cutter is to make sure that the origin is correctly set. The next step is to make an outline of the name tag. Make sure that when you are doing this, that you size it with the lock button unlocked. Otherwise, it will keep the proportions and its size to 90 millimeters by 50 millimeters. The next step is to choose a text option and put a name in the name tag, and then center at the vertical and horizontal centers. In this next step, it's important to note that you can import a logo, for example, our company logo, from a computer by aligning it to the bottom right. An important note here is that you can select more than one thing without selecting everything by holding the control and using the left click button. Along with typing the text, you can size it as well, aligning it to the bottom left. You also want to bring in the text about a millimeter up and a millimeter right of the edge of the name tag, otherwise the bottom might be cut off. I'm also adding text to show my position at the company and adding that text box to the name tag. Next, I can change the lettering on the tag to an engraving setting by selecting the lettering and then hitting the blue square at the bottom. You can see this reflected in the top right when the color changes to blue. Your next decision will be to determine if you want the actual cutout line to be the last step to happen. The cuts and engravings happen in the order listed in the top right, which can be adjusted by clicking on them and hitting the up and down arrows. You'll want to make sure to have line as the last cut on your job so that your name tag does not shift after it has been cut. Your final step is to go to the image settings. Find DPI, which stands for dots per inch. The higher the DPI, the higher the quality of the image will be on your name tag.
At this point, you are now ready to laser cut your name tag. You'll want to frame the laser to make sure the cut will actually fit on the material provided. This draws an imaginary outline onto the material you're cutting on before actually cutting. The engraving of the text will happen first. Once the engraving is done, then the name tag will be cut out. Your name tag is now complete and can easily be adapted for other images and other names and can be quickly created in a matter of seconds. For more tutorial videos on laser cutting, please check our website at www.firstmakerspace.com.